You're my daughter. It's my job to look out for you. Netflix is that 90s show part three introduces the never before seen uncle of Bob Pinciotti, yet still leaves the family's largest unanswered question untouched. The Foreman family tree was exhaustively explored throughout that 70s show, from introducing Red and Kitty's parents and siblings to Eric's cousins, but the Pinciotti family tree was essentially untouched outside of Donna, Midge, and Bob themselves. With Donna and Eric's kid taking the spotlight on that 90s show, the sequel series is finally filling in the gaps by introducing family members from Leia's mom's side. With Bob Pinciotti officially living in Point Place again ahead of that 90s show part two's ending, Don Stark's legendary character receives a bigger focus as he bonds with his granddaughter during the summers. This includes finally getting to meet some of Bob's family, who have obviously been living in Point Place all along, which begs the question of why they were never introduced or addressed at his and Midge's vow renewal in that 70s show. Regardless, Bob's Italian uncle's revelation solves a puzzle about what the other Pinciatis are like outside of Donna's parents. That 90s show finally introduces a member of Bob Pinciati's family. Bob Pinciati finally meets his uncle Spogira in that 90s show, Part 3, Episode 1. This marks the first time that the program has cast a member of Bob Pinciotti's extended family, providing a more complete portrayal of Donna's wonderful father. Bob calls in Spogira, who only communicates in Italian, to help fix the wall that Leo's son Sonny, Kevin Smith, left in the foreman's kitchen after crashing his car into the house. Bob says that Uncle Spogira observed the Empire State Building's construction in New York, which apparently gives him the qualifications to rebuild a wall. Considering Bob's uncle is in point place. The door is now open for more Pinciotti family members to join that 90s show's ensemble of characters in the future. However, while Spogira and Bob do mention another previously unknown family member named Maria, it's hinted that she perished. However, with the return of Michael Kelso's daughter Betsy in that 90s show part 3, the sequel series ensures the inclusion of the extended relatives of the legendary Point Place families. That 90s show still hasn't solved the mystery of Bob and Midge's daughter, Tina. While it's thrilling to meet more members of Bob, Donna, and Leia's family in that 90s show, Netflix's sitcom has yet to answer the Pinciatis main mystery from the original season. Donna had a sister named Tina, who appeared in one episode before never being seen or discussed by the characters again. While it is evident that the show decided to remove Donna's sister behind the scenes, there has never been an on-screen explanation for the character or her subsequent absence. In season one of that 90s show, Red hinted that Donna doesn't have sisters, saying, there's only one girl in the world with Bob as her father. This seemed to be the final blow to the show's attempt to reintroduce Tina and deceive viewers into thinking she had always been there. Unfortunately, while this remains one of the most significant retcons and unexplained aspects of that 70s show, it appears unlikely that Bob would provide a satisfactory explanation to the mystery surrounding Tina Pinciotti in that 90s show.